Hello and welcome to Econ Premium. Today we will see how we can do this is AliExpress drop shipping setup. Okay, here we have all set up a jewelry product store with products from AliExpress already by using Ubolo. But now we will see how we can move on to desserts. So we will go into the app section of our store and from there we will be clicking on Ubolo. We are opening Ubolo now. After opening Ubolo, you will see that it is saying that you have to migrate to desserts uh, after 15 June. Ubolo app and your historical data will no longer be accessible. So there is one option so we can migrate it from here and another option is to install this app from Shopify App Store. So we will be clicking on migrate it from here. Click to continue. After clicking continue you see it's processing now. Once it's done, it will ask you to install the app. You can simply install app from here by clicking on here. In the automation process, it will ask you to migrate all your data from Ubalu to DSS. So if you have uh, if you don't have any account on Jesus yet, you can have create a new account here like this. Simply write your email and password. And then you can select a password. So here we have select uh, email and password. Now we will create account on this cell. Okay, our account has been created. Now it's taking us to this app now. And now the data migration is in process. You have to click on start migration here. Okay, in migration it will ask you to copy the settings and then copying the orders, previous orders, orders in Oberlo and then products from all products from Oberlo app that has been taken from AliExpress already by using Oberlo and uh, after syncing products it will be ready to work as a DSS. Once your app is successfully integrated DSS, you can then link AliExpress by clicking on here. Okay, so here you can select our already existing account of AliExpress and then click on sign in. So you can simply verify and then you can sign in into AliExpress. Okay, it's asking DSS authorization for access you have to click on authorize after linking aliexpress with dsers your dsers is ready now your store is connected and uh, is syncing your volvo data to your dsers account now once all the products are migrated, all the data is migrated to this search, it will be also green. So it's saying zero step is left. So here you see we have D uh, We we don't have we have no longer need of this overload because once it's processed and completed you can delete overload. But before you can keep your Make sure that you have all Uberlo products available in your d now. As you see, these all jewelry products were taken from AliExpress by using Uberlo. So, here you see all the products in 
these are the accounts now. So this was the integration of how you can install Jesus and start doing Jesus AliExpress drop shipping on Shopify. Just another method of installing Jesus by clicking on apps in your Shopify store and then go to Shopify app store from here. After going to Shopify app store, you see that you can install Jesus from Shopify app store by searching Jesus. Then you will search Jesus here. You see there is Jesus AliExpress dropshipping app available in the Shopify store, and uh, we have already installed it. Then it will be same for you guys that install app. You can still click on install, and uh, it will be a simple process. And then you will have Jesus will be available in your app store. You can just refresh your Shopify admin, and you will see Jesus dropshipping. AliExpress top shipping app here like this and then you can go to this app by clicking on it. So after installing Jesus and syncing products with Jesus, if you are newly starting top shipping on Jesus, you see that you need to install a Chrome extension Jesus from um, Google Chrome store and then you have to go to AliExpress like this once you will go to aliexpress you can simply click on any product after installing the search app chrome extension app so don't forget to sign in into aliexpress form from here once you are signed in you can click on access now So you are signed in into AliExpress. You can go to any product from here, just like this jewelry product. We have opened this, right? Like this. After opening the product, take the jewelry product or any other product that you want, like this. Here we see, we will see, we will look at this jewelry product now. Open it up and uh, from here you can click on Jesus AliExpress extension and it's asking for option, AliExpress standard shipping and all other. You can check this shipping time period we will suggest USPS and then country from where you want to ship and uh, the currency update setting once you update the settings you see this and then you can simply refresh this page after enabling Jesus Okay, as you know, we have already installed Oballo, so we will be now checking that all of our data has been processed or not. We will be deleting Oballo now, not to see this in AliExpress. You can delete Oballo app because it's already expiring on 15th of June. So you can also delete this overload Chrome extension from here, you can remove it from your Chrome. So now we will again refresh this page. We'll see how these sets work. Okay, it's it's here showing that add to D set. We'll click on add to D cells from here and here you see it's importing now this product to D cells. Okay, AliExpress product import success. We will be now going to our product list in Jesus. So, 
in the AliExpress, you will see that product, just newly imported product. Here you see the product was soap velvet. So we see where the soap velvet is. Okay, here you see I think this is the product we're looking for. Just look at the price and everything. And uh, okay, we will be going into import list. After importing from AliExpress, you can see the product import in the import list. Just click on it. Open this product. It will, you can confirm that which product is this and then from here you can edit it here like uh, you can edit the thumbnail uh, the title accordingly and then you can also put it up in some collection like this already created collection and then the type you can also give some tag you can also select some vendors in your store to have already created and then in the variants you can select how many variants you want to go with like all variants or some variants so here then you can edit the description like this and then in the images and then shipping information And also you can select the country from here, where which country do you want to ship these products to. So we have selected United States. And uh, then you can see that the very best shipping is this one with DHL. It's 10 days. So you can say then click on save. And uh, in here you see that we can also look at this in the variants you see you can update the price and uh, the cost is this one price value is this compared price you can change the price so it will be showing like this right so now click on save and then you can push this product after editing into your shop file. Once the product has been successfully pushed, you will see this thing. You can also import reviews if you have installed those reviews. So now we will be going into the product in our shop file store. We'll be closing all other setting pages and uh, here you can search so okay here you see our product is on our shop by store now you can also give a sale channel to your product from here in the shop file like you can open it like this to let show and work properly okay after refreshing sometimes it takes time in Shopify you see here is a product and uh, you can also manage the sales channel and apps Once the product is fully opened, you can 
You can manage search channel and you can give it one search channel access so it can be available for shopping. And then click on save. Once it's saved with same one save channel, don't forget to check the status of active or drop. If it's in drop, it won't be able to uh, for your clients to buy it by this one. So here you see the product has been successfully added to our shopper store like this. So if you are going to collection, we put this in a collection card box. So if you are opening the collection page in your shopper store, you will see that product as well like this. So this has been added through Deezer. We will be also coming up with another video in which we will be showing you how you can fulfill order on your Shopify with Jesus. Thank you so much for watching. To like the video, do subscribe the channel and hit the bell icon so others can also know about this. Thank you so much. Bye bye.